Little did I know that I was gonna get COVID by just being at home. We normally do a lot of things outside and we never gotten sick, not even a cold. Um, but my husband does work outside and he actually was close to people that had COVID. And he has been testing himself every, every week. And they all come back negative. But then he really started to feel very sick he went back for another test result and then they came back positive. So the next day, right after he got his test results, the next day I started to feel a sore throat. And and I, I started to feel dizzy. It, it was almost like I could just pass out. And so I decided to go and also test myself. My son was feeling the same way. So we both went the same day. Funny that his test results were negative and mine were positive, even though he had symptoms. So we went back to get his get give him a new test results. So he did ended up testing positive the second time. So I guess I feel that if you're not too far in with the sickness or the symptoms, they come back negative. So if you're feeling symptoms don't discard that you don't have it you just have to wait a little bit give you a couple more days and go get tested again it's very important that you know where you stand so you can protect others um, i can say that based on my experience this has been week two and i would say that my symptoms have been mild i've had every symptoms in the in the list except for vomiting and diarrhea those are the only two that thank god i have not um encountered yet um today i actually felt a little better um so i decided to make this video the only thing that i've um encountering is that my heart rate is higher than normal so i've actually kind of lost like 10 pounds just i within these two weeks so I'm hoping that it does go back down and the virus just leaves my body, but it's not it's not as bad as some people would describe it for me, for myself, as a flu. I've had a flu that has been really bad. Um, this, These were all just, I just got all the, a sample of all the symptoms, like here's your cough, here's your muscle aches, here's your body aches. Um, kind of in that sequence. Um, I've been sleeping a lot and I've been very, very thirsty. Um, other than that, I feel fine. I feel my lungs are fine. Um, I'm not coughing too much or having too much phlegm. So given that our symptoms um, were mild to moderate, um, we're taking care of ourselves in the house we are making sure that we eat, we're making sure that we stay hydrated and that we get lots of sleep because um, our body's gonna need it, especially at times throughout the day. I feel my heart rate is just elevated and I have to like go back to sleep so I can bring it down because that's where I feel shaky and I feel like I'm dizzy. So don't go out and start doing things just because you feel that you that you can that oh it's gone no it's not gone it's gonna show up later it's gonna manifest later my 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 symptoms were getting manifested at night i was good throughout the day and boom comes the night i get them all the symptoms all at once and it knocks me out and that's when then i was starting to feel anxiety of when the night was coming i i didn't know what was going to happen at night if I was going to get worse or, or, or was something's going to happen at night. So it's a little bit, it's a little bit worrying, not knowing how you're going to be at night. If that is when you're, when you're displaying all the symptoms. Uh, so things that we have been doing to take care of our situation at home is we're making sure that um, we stay hydrated, that we eat, that we monitor ourselves. We actually bought these little watches to monitor our oxygen levels and our heart rate. Um, if we need to get to have something in the house, 
we really don't want anybody to come over and be exposed or have them running around for us so what we do is we order on amazon anything that we might need you can basically order even groceries you can order so thankfully you can have things still shipped to your house um, so you don't have to go anywhere and you can get the rest that that you need um, so in my household it's me it's my husband my son and i and there's days where one of us feel better so one of us will go and make a meal or um, clean the house or tidy up so we're kind of um, tagging each other on how we feel and um, trying to get on with with this the day-to-day -day basics um, in the household but don't ever think that you're exempt from getting COVID um, because I was really surprised it would be one of the it would it was one of the last things that I thought I would get um, and it really scared me for a little bit there um, my son he's young so he's gonna resist it he he's 20 20 um, 24 years old um, I'm 46 my husband is 49 and we are still going through the motions but we feel much better um, thankfully in a in a few days this would all be gone continue to stay safe I'm not gonna say stay home because actually that's where I got it um, that would be kind of like um, redundant to say at this time um, but please do take measures if you're feeling any symptoms if you're feeling even a cold um, immediately get the test stay away from everybody let them know that you're sick so you don't infect them as well so with that said i will catch up with you later